Time to make a day in a life video that won't take forever to process. So in case you weren't sure what that montage was all about back just now, um, I was running some errands for um, for uh, the rest of the week. I got a Wawa, I mean, I got a coffee and a sandwich from from Wawa. And uh, speaking of which, where is that sandwich? I must have left it downstairs. Anyway, I went to um, went to uh, Dollar General and got some uh, snacks that I tried to get last week, but ran out of money. And um, and I stopped at the beer place to get a slushy, which you'll see in just a few hours. Well, in real time. In this video, it's probably going to be more like uh, 12 minutes tops, but we'll see. Anyway, I'm going to go get that sandwich. Oh, here it is. You know, I really thought that when I filmed this Tuesday in the Life video that uh, I would have work, but... You know, after the new year rang, uh, COVID cases started spiking up and business was slow. So hopefully there will be some work for me next week. Why am I so out of breath? I haven't been walking around that much, have I? Well, whatever. Anyway, I'm going to enjoy this lunch and uh, while I enjoy some total drama episodes... I really need to, hold on, let me lower the TV. Watching Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Pretty underrated show, especially by the standards of Marvel, whom according to a lot of people are the only company that can still make good movies. Well, great movies. So, uh, yeah, as, as I was saying, um, the reason why I'm trying to keep this video under 30 minutes is because with the editing software I use, it won't, uh, I mean, it won't upload to YouTube right away. It takes an indefinite amount of time to, uh, upload. So, um, uh, yeah, my Sunday in the Life video probably could have been shorter, except, uh, I did a, a house tour in the same video. And the second one was... The Monday in the Life video was about uh, me having the Monday in the Life video was uh, basically just um, me just showing the ins and outs of my job and why it isn't as easy as some people would think. Got a little long after I uh, showed you what uh, after I showed you what I did after work toward the end of the video which to to just tell you I typically watch uh, YouTube videos unless 
unless I'm behind on some paid streaming services like, you know, HBO Max, Netflix, Disney Plus, etc. Unless it's only half a work day, in which case I try to watch a little in each streaming service. I need to charge this phone, but I guess I'll have to use my uh, camcorder footage. I mean, the sun goes down on the other side of the house, but there is a house across the street that uh, that the sun reflects on, you know, the, the windows and it makes its, and the light makes its way in this room, making it hard to see the TV. So, yeah, um, I uh, just, just um, yeah, you probably can't really see it. I can't really, uh, there, there isn't a flash on, there isn't a light on this side of the camera. But um, even if there was, it doesn't matter because the battery is too low to have the light on. But uh, I just finished my Wawa coffee and I put the remaining ice cubes in a glass that I'm going to use to pour some orange Sunkiss, some Sunkiss orange soda in. If there are trace amounts of coffee in there, so be it. Might add some nice flavor. I'm usually pretty good with my drink mixing, so. It's a bit late, but it took me a while to, um, you know, figure out how to, uh, you know, finally get the new SD card I bought to uh, unlock. There's some stupid setting that means the password is, that it's a protected card, whatever the hell. Well, actually, I do know uh, what that is, but it, it's kind of stupid that it's bought like that. Uh, supposedly, it has to do with the switch on the side of every SD card, but the uh, the S the new SD card keeps sliding back up when you put it in. So anyway, I finally. Uh, figured out that I don't have to sit in a dark room, I could just uh, use one of the lights in my room. So, um, I was on Netflix, now I'm on Disney Plus, but um, I want to show you this candle. Yeah, this is the, um, This is the uh, PC that I edit all my videos on. Although I also have an app on my phone that I use to download all my shorts on. I'll be downloading a short pretty soon, like less than a week after I upload this. So, um, yeah, um, sometimes I pretend I'm in. You know, sometimes I pretend I'm an author from the 1900s, and uh, I like to uh, keep a nice little candle handy while I uh, while I edit my videos. Pretend I'm you know, working for a company, you know, uh, publishes uh, my work. In this case, it's uh, it's YouTube. And who knows what editor I would have worked for in another life in the uh, 1800s. I mean, I don't, I don't know much about liter historic literature. Anyway, um, yeah, this candle is what I'm currently using. Mm, it's not my, it's not my favorite scent, but you know, I, I didn't really choose it. It was, um, it was a birthday pre, it was a Christmas present. Um, it, it doesn't light very well. The wicks are very small, so when when it hits the wax, it the flame gets pretty dim. But I have an idea. Let's see. Let's see if it works.
My idea is I will only light one wick and if the flame dies out because of the wax I can just uh, do this put all the wax on one side increase the lifeline of the wick progress on it later see how well it worked you know this really isn't one of my best videos so uh... You know, forget about everything you just slept through let's uh... take a look at what i got for christmas start with i uh, got all eight seasons of game of thrones right there and uh... as i've said before, I don't know if I edited it out or not, um, I got a, a new set of SD cards. What I've been doing before I got them is I've basically just been deleting footage after, uh, you know, after I'm done uploading it, but as soon as I find an adapter with a switch that won't slide back down, I'm going to uh, gonna be able to uh, uh, keep the footage that I delete. I mean, not that I really have anything to keep after it's been uploaded, but you know, thing is, if you keep deleting footage from the SD cards for this camcorder, it can be bad for the camcorder. So it really is for the best that I have these as a backup. Now let's see, what did I get that isn't edible? I usually get just mostly get candy. So, uh, yeah, let me, uh, I already uh, expressed that I got the candle. I also got a gift card that gets me an annual subscription to Disney Plus which I'm currently using now, as I previously stated. Also got this new calendar. By the way, Happy New Year, everyone, in case I didn't say that already. Which I think I did in my last short, but I know for a fact y'all haven't seen it, because it's still at three views, and all of them are mine. I also got a pair of Bluetooth earbuds that my brother gave me. Yeah. I pretty much always have them plugged in unless I'm going out. And the one I'm least proud of is, hold on, Walking Dead World Beyond Season 1. Kind of, uh, Kind of a low point in the TWD franchise, but it's The Walking Dead, you know, you gotta collect them all. Can't really see in this lighting, but I just. But the one wick I lit was still burning brightly, so. Decided to light the other one just now. Dear Lord and Savior, rest this food upon us. Huh. And, uh, I turned the camera on and it didn't click. Yo, chill, yo, chill. Come on. At the poker table again, girl? You got a problem. It's pretty, though. You know, technically, when I played that game, I... I'm just gonna fast forward through that. Oh, well, looks like she was only on there for like two minutes. Well, there have been times where she was at the poker table for two and a... For an hour and a half for no reason. I mean, granted, I was on there multiple times for multiple occasions, but that was for the 100% completion. I did not enjoy doing it. No, she's doing it for the hell of it. So what does that tell you? 
Uh, fast forward to. Oh, this I'm Ju I'm watching Julia TV's uh, video. By the way, she's been live streaming Red Dead Redemption too, and uh, I've been uh, enjoying it. Although I do a lot of fast forwarding, however, mainly to the uh, main cutscenes. A few changes to this room. For instance, I have the ceiling light on instead of the light. Because uh, the bolt busted up. Let me let me show you what I mean. That third click, all three lights were supposed to turn off. I can't. Yeah, I am not used to having this room not lit up for, after one simple switch. Yeah, I mean, granted it was, granted it was only a matter of time. The uh, the bulb I used was at least five watts more powerful than the other two, but the original bulb blew out, and I and I didn't have one with a small enough wattage that could also fit inside the uh, the lamp, so. Yeah, I guess it was only a matter of time. I guess I, at some point I'm going to have to replace it. So, another thing. Finally, uh, you know, finally got out my smoothie. I just finished my Coke Zero Sugar, so I'm ready to give this a try. In case you're wondering why that sticker's on top of it, it's because it's an alcoholic drink and you're not really supposed to, uh, you know, walk out of the beer place with an open one. So, in the event that you get pulled over or something, that sticker is there to show the law enforcement that you haven't gone around to drinking it yet. Another thing, the, uh, yeah, I've uh, had this, I wanted the candle wax to uh, harden back up on the side, so... I tilted it between the PS2 console and the lampshade. Yeah, the coloring looks weird, but no, it's it's hardened enough. Later on, I can do the same with that one wick. It it might look weird, but at least now it might look weird, but at least now when I light it, it's um. But at least now when I light it, it, uh, it, it won't be dim. You know, the candlelight won't be dim. Is that a decent candle? That, can, that corner can look really dark. Actual targets. In previous missions, let's just say I've been a little bit more liberal with my methods. A couple of innocent people had katanas stabbed through their heads, others were thrown off cliffs or whatever, but I think for this mission, I'm only killing the actual target. So yeah, it turns out this guy I just smacked with my briefcase is actually the celebrity, so happy coincidence there. I take his Metro Tinkerbell disguise and begin making my way to the tower. So my rough plan is to pretend to be this guy and hopefully just breach past security and then I will need to get Bouchan isolated. I take my machete out of my briefcase and then machete him in the face. I approach the entrance and the security team falls for the disguise that they want to frisk me and check the briefcase. We fall at the first hurdle, but no problem. I ditch my silenced pistol and the briefcase behind a car. A sad moment, as now Bouchan won't be getting macheted, but don't worry, I'll be back for my baby later. I head back to the entrance and this time let the security fondle me, as now they can't take my weapon. They also can't take my dignity because I already lost that when I put on this tiny pair of wings. I head up the stairs, but a lot of the staff seem to know that I am an imposter. I'll have to be careful when Never do that after drinking alcohol and having some Pringles. I realize that T-Series is really trying to get more subscribers by filming some... So... I, uh... 
So, uh, yeah, just a quick update. Um, uh, before I close things off, uh, the day is almost over. So, <clears throat> this uh, ought to be the, uh, the final clip. I just, uh, you know, wanted to make some updates. I'm watching gameplay for uh, Little Nightmare 2. I just, uh, and I'll lit the last wick in my candle. You know, uh, this might not be the most interesting video, but at least I'm keeping it real. You know, I'm, I'm not doing some random stuff just because I'm filming a YouTube video. Like, you know, filming dance moves while holding Nerf guns. Dancing to the sounds of, um, Kenny, who did the song My Shiny Teeth and Me. You know, just dancing to that. No, I'm just keeping it real. I guess... Yeah, so the most interesting thing about my usual days off is pretty much what I'm watching, you know. You know, being, you know, keeping entertained by watching things on YouTube or YouTube or, you know, Netflix or HBO Max, Disney Plus, etc. So, I mean, yeah, you could I mean, sure, I could have turned this into a React video, but that's, uh, but that's, you know, not what this is. This is a day in the life video. If you're not keeping it real, then, I don't know, then what are you doing? This might not be my most interesting video, but I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and I will see you soon for the next one. As always, Dr. Stephen James, say peace. Later, guys. See you soon.